After a seven-year-old girl is shot in West Baltimore, police announce arrests in the case. Two people have been charged in connection with the death of Taylor Hayes. Today, Taylor's mother spoke for the first time publicly since her daughter's murder. And WJZ is live outside City Police Headquarters. Avajoy Burnett has more on her emotional message. Avajoy. Well, Mary, today, Baltimore City Police announced a couple has been arrested and charged in connection to Taylor's murder. Today, her mother spoke for the very first time since her daughter died, and she begged the city to stop the violence. All the killing, it got to stop. It have to. It's kids getting killed. I never see my child again, ever. Shanika Robinson spoke publicly for the first time since her seven year old daughter was shot and killed. We have to come together. It has to stop. I buried my baby. Friday, police charged 29 year old Keon Gray with murder and his girlfriend with being an accessory to the crime. This should not happen. The interim police commissioner praised the community who called in tips and investigators who tracked Gray down to Anne Arundel County. On July 5th, Taylor was shot in the back as she sat in a car near Edmondson Avenue. Despite the grief, her family had gratitude. It was just outstanding work. Like, we gratefully appreciate it from the bottom of our heart. We gratefully appreciate everything, every tip. This memorial marked the spot where first responders scooped up Lita Taylor and rushed her down to shock trauma. While this happened more than a month and a half ago, the community here has not forgotten her smile. People are thankful. From what I've gotten some texts and calls, people are relieved that you know somebody will hopefully be brought to justice for uh, for her death. Um, and I think it does give us some hope that we can, you know, that the police department is, is making gaining ground. Taylor was supposed to start second grade this fall. I lost my daughter. You know, they still got their kids. I don't have my seven-year-old daughter anymore. Now, the prosecutor reiterated that Gray is innocent until proven guilty. Back to you.